Alright. Welcome, and we are playing Dimitrios today. That's how you pronounce it, right? The Big Cynical Adventure. I've never even did a pre-test or anything on this. It's going straight into it blind. Just noticed several things on the uh, background here, so we might have an idea what's going, what we're getting into. I think we might be in France because of this year. Drink milk. Like, what a, is this the 90s now? Of a broken window. Mystery. The angle of that chair is perspectively wrong. That is really bugging me. Just look at that. It's just, it's just pissing me off. <laughs> <laughs> Saw that wrong. And this is spelled wrong. Garage is spelled wrong. Or maybe it's spelled right. Since it's not in English. Not, did I just. Yeah. In English. France. We still don't know if we're actually in France. For as far as we know, we may be in Texas. That would explain the bad spelling, wouldn't it? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, don't kill me. And what's this shit here? Looks like someone holding out like a device or a fishing pole or some shit. Or it could be a potted plant for all I know. The moon is really oddly small. I kind of like the, the flow of going on back here. It's a little weird. But it's still kind of nice visually. His neck is all twisted, so he's. he's I, I don't even know if he's clearly alive anymore. <laughs> New game, load, options, exit. What's, what's in our options here? Make friendly UI here, huh? This looks like it was made for a, a uh, handheld device. Like an iPad or some shit. Here we have the display. Wait, was that was that turd on there? I don't know. I think that's boiled meat. Francios douche espanol. Italiano. Thanks. I have now fitted to like so many countries now. <laughs> you think special effects? I think that's all there is to that. New game. Said that there's up to 14 to 16 hours of gameplay in this. Paris, a hot July night. My name is Bjorn. Bjorn? I don't know. Oh yes, Bjorn Thonen. Sorry, I'm a bit drunk currently. Anyway, on that fateful night, I got a call. A phone call. Uh, hello? Mr. Thonin? Who, who knows the, the person named Mr. Thonin? But that's me, but who... I need to warn you. You are in grave danger! What the? Oh, I get it. Good prank. <laughs> Night. No, wait, don't. If only I had known this phone call would change my life forever. Later that night. Crack. Crack! That's more like a creak. Boom! That's not even a boom! Bash, maybe, but not a boom. It's a noise, someone in my apartment. Uh, I did the first thing that came to mind. Took a flashlight and moved towards the living room. There seemed to be nothing. But then, bam! Hey, at least I got a sound effect right. I fell flat on the floor. Fire. Uh, what is this, juvenile? Is that an important clue? <laughs> A few hours later, I woke up suddenly. That sound! The phone! I ran to pick it up. Hello? Bajorn, why the hell are you still home? 
Ah, Tom, I had some trouble. Th that face. It's like that mustache isn't wanting to work with a smile. That, that's artistically bothering me, too. <laughs> ah, Tom, I had some trouble. Don't tell me you forgot we were fishing today. Come here at once. That seems like a, re a really strong demand for fishing. <laughs> yeah, we fish to relax. Really? Sorry, I don't think it'll come. I have some important matters to attend to. You, you couldn't even tell him that you got bashed in the back of the head? Knowing you, I guess you won't change your mind. That sounds like a compliment, if I ever heard one. Alright then, just come for dinner this evening. You can tell me more then. How rousing. Alright, I'll do my best. Look at that shit-eating grin. I, I, I guess that means they really like each other. Ouch, my head hurts. What happened already? I guess because you fell for the pretty face. I think someone was in my apartment. He must have knocked me out. Before reporting to the police, I'd better check and see if anything's missing. Look at that fucking chair. Look at that fucking... It's not... It's not sitting on, like, a floor like it should be. Bedside lamp, stone painting, trash bag. A fucking shoe. Bedroom, covered doors, bathroom, exit, mirror, radiator, another shoe, armchair, bag of chips. Now we have our priorities straight there. Game console, drawer, door, DVD player, TV, ugly piece of pottery. Where do I keep it then? Withered flower, closet, power outlet. Man, lots of choices. Clock, can. Alright, let's actually start clicking on these instead of accepting them. Wait, why do I have a plaque in my living room? There's a cookie here. Weird, I can't remember the last time I bought cookies. Oh well. I got a cookie. What do I could do with that? Um, you could eat it. Cookies are special items scattered on each screen. Oh, seriously, what, why do you, why do you question cookies? Like, what, what, what am I gonna do with a cookie? I don't know, the one in the fucking trash you found on the floor? You know, right? <laughs> the cookies are special items scattered on each screen. There are three cookies on each screen. Pick them up to use the end game help icon in the top bar when you're stuck. Piero della Francisca. Yeah, I, I'm sure I completely ruined that. I should not be saying words I can't pronounce. In fact, my friend Noel is probably going to kill me for saying that. It could mean Stone of Friends. Wait, you don't know? You don't know what it says and you, it's in your damn apartment? Or maybe french fries? Oh, you. You are a stranger bastard than I. Stone painting. This painting is really something. There are several interpretations for the pattern, though. According to ancient aliens theorists... You, I think you said that wrong. This represents a UFO destroying the Earth on Judgment Day. But some others say the truth is out there. But, but that's the saying the same thing! It's saying the same thing! I don't know why you'd even say that it's a Judgment Day thing, that, that UFO's clearly just zipping along. It's a happy sunny day. And aliens must be happy too, I guess. I like to read my comics here. That's why I needed a lamp. Couldn't put it anywhere else. But it's useless. Look at the perspective. If you turn it on, it's not going to go through your armchair for you, for you to read comics comfortably. Do you just you, do you just sit on the floor? You still could have put the lamp somewhere better for that. Oh. Oh. I just realized the implications is that there's a trash bag here. On the floor. What the... Hey, it wasn't like this yesterday. Sure. Mister, I'm going to sit on the floor to read comics. The burglar must have stepped on it. Th that implies that it was there before. Seriously, what kind of thief trips over the trash bags? 
See, see, you totally, you're, you're, you, you're a pig. Filthy. One of my boots. My favorites for winter. They keep your feet warm. Uh, yeah, that's that's what a boot is. I wonder where the other one is. Are you blind? Are you blind too? Well, I guess I'm his eyes. So. Ah, there it is. Great. Not that I'll be wearing them. It's 100 degrees outside. Fahrenheit. If we're in France. Why are we in using Fahrenheit? Don't we use imperial standards and shit like that? I don't know. I'm completely ignorant as an American. Radiator. It looks like a big old frying pan. I'm sure you'd use it like one too. I swear, I cooked eggs on it once. Hey, look, I was right. Garbage on the fucking floor. It's looking good. Oh. Sure, buddy. Totally not a zombie or anything. Okay, I might need to find a doctor for this guy. That armchair looks nice, but actually it's awful. After sitting in it for an hour, I can't get out of it. But isn't that the kind of best armchair? This guy's standards. Oh, I lost that packet of crisps last month! Oh. I guess he would eat the cookie then. Wait, but then if he would eat a cookie off the floor... Ugh. Not only a DVD player, but it also reads VHS cassettes. How luxurious. Salesman told me it was the all new next gen must have console. Somehow I feel cheated. Nintanka. It's stuck. I can't open it. Weird, there's no lock. There are only magazines in this drawer. More precisely, hundreds of TV channel listings. It's a power socket. Although this makes me think, I've always wondered what it really does if you put your finger in there. You seem like the guy who would test that, you know? Just just test it. Try it? Yeah, let's just do it. Here lies Bajoran Thonin. Found dead in his apartment after his neighbor complained about a foul odor. What? I died on the first screen! Yes, yes you did. Huh, it seems to have kept my place. What's this? Oh, I borrowed this DVD from Tom! Snow White and the Three Little Pigs! I love cartoon movies. Reminds me of my childhood. One disc, none special DVD. Snow White and Three Little Pigs. Oh. 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 Okay. Uh, what's that X rating on the back? Probably a mistake. I lost the remote control, so it's stuck in the cooking fan channel. Only cooking programs, yawn. Yes, let's watch some cartoons. Can't wait. Sexy Max Films. Never heard of that studio. Here's Snow White. Uh, what's that big doing? Hey, stop it. Don't you hear me screaming? Well, now that's all. Oh, wait, don't you hear me screaming? What? Now that's why I call a modernized remake. Apparently he enjoyed it. My aunt bakes pottery. She gave me this. I couldn't bring myself to throw it out. Why? Withered plant? Wow, I should really stop touching it now. <laughs> Not touch it again. Arg! And there goes the beautiful pottery Auntie gave me. What a shame. What the? That thing isn't broken? How's that even possible? It fell from six feet high. Hey, what's that? A few fun fair coins from last year. Cool. Got 20 fun fair coins. What a coincidence. The fun fair starts tomorrow. Wow, that's unusually coincidental. I'll put these coins aside for now. Hmm. 
My vacuum iron cleaning products. Useless stuff. When you say that, makes me think it's more porn shit. That one's totally empty. I swear! Aside from that 100 cockroaches living in there. There's only a big piece of sheet in there. That's an angry bowl. That's a happy bowl. Sheet with two E's. Uh-huh. Ah, uh, yes, I remember now. That's the only door with a lock, so I keep some cash in there. Now the question is, where's that key? Oh, wait, 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 no, 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 no. We just missed a few things. What is this? Looks like a can of food. I should grab it. It's high. So high. Not high enough, though. Got a can. So good. Cassolette. Sausage flavor. With twice the sausages. This can can contains two sausages. Wow, that's... It sounds absolutely brilliantly disgusting. Best before October 1998. Well, they say it's best to eat it before that date. Not required. Good enough for me. Oh my god. Like clockworks. Like clockwork. Or not. Was that an attempt at a joke, guy? To the closet first. Why are you keeping pampas grass here? Weird, I heard these things grow in closets, but mine don't. Maybe I should have watered it. I can't pull the curtain back any further. There's nothing interesting behind it anyway. Pocket. I put my wallet here. Let's see. Uh-oh. Something's wrong. It's empty. I've been robbed! Cash! Credit card! All gone. Well, that shouldn't be a surprise. The thief must have taken it. At least he left my ID. What a gentleman. Bajorn Thonin. 3-1-V-8-2... What? Oh, no. It's 3 11 82. <laughs> He's just a little bit older than me. Sex, not available. Ha <laughs> ha, funny. Stop reading this, you fool. Interesting. Goodbye, shopping plans. Fortunately, I stored some spare money in that cupboard. But where's that key to open it? My cousins are very religious. They offered me this. Oh, suck it there, I thought it was panties. Well then, what the hell is it? They said it's the Angel of Beauty and Purity. I use it to scare away insects. I can't stand ties. Then why do you own one? The awful feeling of having your throat squeezed, suffocating. Uh, I think I know why he owns one. That bag is really mysterious. Let's have a look-see. Hmm, well, after looking inside, I think it's better to leave that mystery alone. Great. I don't need an umbrella for now. The sun is shining. I'm absolutely certain there's something useful here, like a key or something. Ugh, need to get up a little bit closer. But I can't see a thing. Does that mean he needs light? With this weather, I'd look really stupid with an umbrella. I mean, well, more stupid than usual. Some great books I got for super cheap. Only one euro each. Aha, so we are in, like, France. I guess that wasn't really a hard deduction, but at least it's confirmed. I love these things. They remind me of Christmas, even if I don't like Christmas that much. My parents never gave me any present. They said it was too commercial and that Santa doesn't exist. How could they lie to me like that? Urgent? Urgent box. Oh yes. I put some urgent things to do inside a few years ago. Totally forgot about it. I guess I guess it was quite urgent. 150 mochures? I'm pretty sure that's 
uh, napkins and all that. No, not napkins, you dumbass. Um, it was, uh... Oh, fuck it. I forgot one of the simplest fucking things in the world, and I just... Oh, hello. These are handcuffs. I don't need them for now. Belt. Now, what's that belt doing here? Oh, yeah, I remember now. Silly me. Oh, yeah, see? That, that, that tie. Carnival mask, so cool. Wearing that, no one can see who you are. Oh, for, oh, I forgot I had this. A mini vibrating Eiffel Tower. Say, it still has batteries. These could come in handy. Hey, that is handy. I'll just put that aside. Is there anything else in there? The paper. I know this could be... Would be better next to my printer, but I don't have one. <laughs> Why do you have it? It's totally empty. Never put anything inside. Maybe that's why. I really just want to say, oh, it's gone. Still, Eiffel Tower vibrator sounds absolutely terrible. Horrifying, really. Mm. Right. <laughs> oh my. I, I thought I was questioning him before. I thought this is kind of cool. What the hell is this? I got the statue a few months ago. Here, I thought he was tasteless. I don't know what exactly that bird is supposed to represent, but it looked cool! Hey, wait a minute. Ooh, that music. A <laughs> turd! What the hell? Just look at that on the things. It looks like people here. There was a tablet on it earlier. I remember it clearly because it fell when I moved the statue last week. Fine, now I put it back. It was a tablet shaped like a lightning bolt? It's gone, and I don't see it anywhere else here. So the thief must have taken it, but why? I better tell the police about that. I've gathered all kinds of doodads in these... doodas? Doodads? No, it's doodads in these bags. I don't want to get rid of them, but at the same time, I have no intention of touching these ever again. Hey, that's me, but you're the pirate. Arr. What is he, Indiana Jones in his spare time? Recently, I made an advertisement for a pro blah, 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 blah. Recently, I made an advertisement to promote my store. I brought Oh my god. I brought all that stuff here to take a picture. So it'll look more authentic. You this, this would not make a good scenic picture. That would, but that's like it. Should I ask about the coffin? Rather handy. If I have a heart attack, they could just put me inside this directly. Well, it's cheaper. I have it all prepaid and shit, I guess. The plates. Let's look at the plates. There's nothing distinctly interesting about them, frankly. Really nice plates. I got them for 50 magical points at my supermarket. Oh, really? Le Jacond. The Meno Lisa. Yep, this is the man's reconstruction of Mona. It was made by an artist named Leonardo, Leonardo, Leonardo da Vinci. Okay. Comics are fun. I mostly love European comics such as Tantan, Anthrax, or Lucky Lake. The, the hell is Anthrax? That, that sounds concerning. La Biblia. La Biblia. That's the Spanish version. Spanish or not doesn't make much difference. I wouldn't understand a word of it anyway. Ecological Dictionary. No lie. That's definitely an ecological book. All the pages are blank. I, I'm not sure I get that joke. Don't waste anything. Salvage everything. Don't waste anything. Oh, dang. Too late. I flushed the toilet. 
Again, why'd you buy it then? This book relates the life of a man who never lived. Henry the... Eleventh. Boring stories. The title sure makes me want to read it. Why'd you buy it? Take out your stuff and scram. Story of a little boy expelled from his home. Oh my god, do I really want to read all these? Yeah, I gotta. I am recording after all, aren't I? The Legend of Little Johnny. And it's not even a joke! Again, I don't get the joke. I will suck you tomorrow. Is that like a vampire thing? It's supposed to be a, a self-help book for people who can't stop eating sweets. Uh-huh, sure. Mickey Quacks. That's a collector's edition. Cooking for idiots. Seems like a book for learning to cook. Who needs me? Who needs that? Not me, anyway. Yeah, because you have the TV blaring all day on it, right? Barbie has big boobs. An educational, I'm sure. Finally, a book that tells the truth. Tells from next year. Says on the cover to update the book next year to read it. Technology. But Barbie has big boobs. That's a really large book for nothing. Manuals. Some of my childhood workbooks. Boring stuff. Chest. I used to store some money and important papers in there. But it was too obvious a hiding spot, so I moved them elsewhere. Anyone home? Mousy? Oh no, no answer. Maybe it died of hunger or something. In here? I doubt it. Poor little newspaper. Alone and naked on the floor. And you're not even interesting, just boring business articles. Why'd you not throw it away then? Wait, oh, I only now notice that the shelf has weird stuff all over it. Clock radio. Oh no, it's reset again. Now I'll be late for work every morning. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm my own boss. What is he? Oh, right. He works at some store. I rarely use my landline phone. Or brother runs his own store. My cell phone has much better sound, and it's so practical. Where is it anyway? Excellent. Socks, socks everywhere. I store my earplugs in there. Yes, the whole drawer is filled with earplugs. I don't travel with my favorite teddy anymore. I won't take the risk of damaging it. It's not that comfortable. Or pretty. But I don't care. When you sleep, you don't notice details like that. Oh, look, a flashlight. My flashlight! I had it in hand when I was knocked out last night. Crappy. There's only one problem. The batteries are dead. I need replacements. Hey, we got a fix for that shit! They're the same size! Good! And then there was light. Uh, don't think there's anything else. All oh, right, there's this. A halberd and a stick? Some kind of weapons, I believe. You're not even sure. They came from my antique store. I can't really remember why I brought them here. That's clearly a katana, maybe? Or maybe it's just a stick. And I... I think that's a Chinese half moon thingy majigger. Only some clothes and underpants in there. Why aren't they with your socks? You know, the underpants that is. Already looked in there. <sighs> did I mess with the clock? Oh, yeah, I did. Lame pun. 